Hey guys, Eddie here. All right, today we're going to be taking a look at this XREXS large digital wall clock, guys, with, with backlight. So I'm excited about this, guys. I need a, a wall clock for my basement area, and I'm going to show you guys how that looks in my basement area also. But we're going to go ahead and open this up and see what we got inside of here. So nice packaging. I like that. First and foremost, they kept it protected. Here we go, we open this up, guys. This also has a remote control with it, which is pretty cool. So now, taking this out, let me see here. So it has mounting holes on the back. I gotta mount this. Uh, let's see what the back looks like. And perfect, okay, I see where the, the mounts go, as you can see right there. So that's pretty cool. So I'll get that all measured out and, and get it hooked up. So. You can see right here it has high, low, and off of the backlight because this does have uh, different settings where uh, you can see it in the daylight or if it's dark out. So a lot of features on here also. So we're gonna talk about some of these in a minute, but also I notice here, if you didn't wanna put it on the wall, right? If you didn't wanna put it on the wall, you can easily have a stand here. And let me move this out of the way. You have a stand here like so, where it stands up. Okay, now it is battery powered. It, uh, it takes four AA batteries, uh, but it also has backup batteries where it will take two uh, AAA batteries. So let me go ahead and put that back down like so. You can see right here, uh, so that's batteries. Oh, look at this, they, it came with batteries. It said it didn't, but it came with batteries. I have four AA batteries in here and also has two AAA batteries for backup power. So that's pretty cool. So I didn't even know I had the batteries in here. So I like that as well. Gave me some batteries. Let me even more, save me a little bit there. So now looking at the features here, guys, all of the features, I have it off, I'm gonna turn it on shortly, uh, but showing you all the different features. It has snooze, has set, 12, 24 hour timer, and it has the timer for, uh, you can keep it in, uh, depending on where you're, where you're at, right? If you go off the Celsius or if you go off of the Fahrenheit, it has that for the temp. Uh, has the alarm setting as well. That's pretty cool. It has an alarm and it also has a timer. So that's pretty cool. You can have an alarm on here. Uh, I love that. And then a little, you know, which I know how to hang pictures and mount them, but it does give you here for the mounting holes. So let me lay that down softly there for the mounting holes where you can know pinpoint exactly where you need to put it at. Uh, there is no guesswork in it. So I'm loving that. Uh, definitely has the clear display display. Uh, it has a, a count up and down timer. So let's turn it on here and see what we get. So I'm going to go to on. All right. Let's see here. Take this plastic film off. Let's see. All right. I'm trying to get it on there. You know what I noticed? I'm going, is it coming on? Let's see. I noticed with the batteries. Um, give me one second here, guys. I noticed with the batteries that, uh, that I don't think they were in right. I saw they were in there, but they had like some plastic around them. So let me get these batteries in and I'll be right back. All right, guys, as you can see here, we have it. Got the batteries rocking and rolling and it's showing us nice big display here, right? I just got to set it up. Like I showed you, shows the day, the time. You can set all of that, uh, the month, uh, the date, the temp, all of that good stuff. And here's the remote also, which is supposed to work up to 65 feet away. Uh, cool thing about it is they gave me batteries for this as well. So I actually love that. You see, I turned it off, turned it on with the remote. I can set it from here, right? Set the, the language, all of that good stuff. Uh, DST, it automatically auto uh, sets itself with daylight savings time as well. So you don't have to worry about that. It's gonna adjust on its own. Uh, I would say any downsides to it, guys, it's a big, nice digital display screen here. So be careful with handling it. Uh, you wanna scratch it up or drop it. So even when I was changing the batteries out, I used this padding where I flipped it over and put the, uh, took the plastic off the batteries and all of that. So that's one thing. And it is battery powered, where now we don't know how long the battery is gonna last. It's, it's, you know, so understand where if you had the corded option where it could last a little bit longer. But then if you want to put it on the wall, you don't want any cords hanging from it, right? And it does let you know when the batteries are low to change them out. So those will be some things. Other than that, I think this is definitely really nice. Uh, if you're looking for a, uh, let's get me turn that back on. If you're looking for 
a nice size wall clock right here. It's about a little over 14 inches for the width and the height is almost, it's pretty much six inches. So what we're gonna do guys, we're gonna put this on the wall and I'm gonna show you how it looks in my basement on the wall. All right guys, so here we have it. Here's the wall clock, I've mounted it here. Nice display uh, on my walls. You can see here, it's giving you the time. It's giving you uh, the day of the week. Daylight savings time is on, the month, the date, uh, also the temperature it goes back and forth between that you can see that so guys here it is in my basement on my wall I've mounted it. So now hey if I don't have the TV TVs off I don't have my phone or computer around. I know the time right off hand uh, also guys uh, What if you don't have to change the batteries out you need to change the time or anything guys and the batteries are still going Remember you do have the remote control here that you can do all of that from all right So with that being said if you looked at this product, I hope this video gave you some value on it